Mrs. Uh, Chair Lady and Mrs. Ravjani, <clears throat> I'm very pleased to be, to be here today. I have been supporting the Iranian opposition and the movement led by you for many years, and I must say it's very encouraging when we look back how much you have reached in these years through your tireless and constant efforts. We had, and I have to remember it, we had the dramatic situation in Camp Ashraf's and Liberty for so many years. You tried very hard, you knocked on every door, and finally you managed to bring everyone out to safe countries after 13 years of constant repressions and dangers in Iraq. It would have been unimaginable a year ago if someone would tell me that this year all Camp Liberty residents will be in safety. So I think you are very right to focus now on the human rights. This, was always been, this has always been the spirit and the essence of your fight. This is a focal point that brings us all together here from different political families and different cultures, social and religious backgrounds. Because human rights are universal and here we all feel equal. So I want to encourage you to keep up your right fight. We need to bring those responsible for the massacre of the political prisoners in Iran in 1988 to justice, especially those who are still sitting in positions of power in Iran today. And I'm sure with, the, with this commitment, freedom and democracy will come to Iran much sooner than we dare to believe today. Thank you.